hi guys welcome back to my channel today actually before i even say that if you're new here my name is felicia elise i am a licensed cosmetologist and i make videos doing my hair um today we're doing a wash and go with two products i am a gel wash and go girl does that make sense I prefer using gels for my wash and goes um, because I like definition, um, but I also like it to last throughout the week. So I'm going to show you what I'm using today and hopefully you enjoy. Right. So first I want to show y'all, oops, I want to show you guys the wash day lineup because my hair, as you can see, is color treated. It is bleached. So this is my shampoo focusing this is the retkin acidic bonding concentrate shampoo and then i went in with the k18 damage shield conditioner and after that i went in with the sacred reconstructing treatment mask um, i have a video using this um i really really like it like i was trying to find something bad to say but here we are. Um, so that's what I used. My leave-in conditioner is the Donna's Recipe Sweet Potato Pie Extra Creamy Leave-In Conditioner. That's what I have all in my hair. My hair is divided into four sections. And I'm going to start with this back section. I have a spray bottle with water in that same Donna's Recipe. So I will use that for the sections as they dry. But for now, the star of the show, we're using the Eco Slate Orange Marmalade and the jello shot and let's get into it. so i'm going to start in this back section of my hair i put my clip on my lock so it stays out of the way a little bit like that so i'm going to start with the orange marmalade and it's a very small container so i'm not going to use a lot And to work it in, I'll be using my pattern brush. Take a little bit of water. Work that in, shingling a few. Taking that orange marmalade. The smell is amazing, and I love a black owned brand. The ingredients are all natural. You have to keep it refrigerated, so that's how you know it's all natural. They are not planned.
Okay, so now that we've completed this whole side, this is just using the orange marmalade so far. Now I'm gonna take the jello shot. Now this one, I watched a lot of videos before using this one because I just wanted to see what it was like. And they say that the hold is really strong. So to combat that, I'm only gonna use a little bit and I'm gonna use it as a topper. So this is my hair all shingled. And I'm just gonna take about this much. We'll call that a dime size amount. And we're just gonna glaze over all the hair. This smells really, really good. can't place it but it smells nostalgic it almost smells like candy it smells really good it feels really good it's very thick I'm gonna scrunch that on top so that way I still get great definition but hopefully it's not too crunchy juicy curls all right so I'm gonna finish the other section and I'll be back So I'm just continuing with the orange marmalade, working that into small sections of my hair. The smell is amazing. That's what I keep saying. So if you see my, my lips moving, it's because I'm raving about the smell. And I'm working that in small sections and using my fingers to shingle and scrunch to bring my curls back. All right, so the section is done. Now I'm gonna take some more of the Jello shot. And we're gonna apply that first on the root. And then praying hands motion. And then scrunch. If you're someone that has a lot of shrinkage with your hair, I don't encourage you to scrunch at all. I encourage you to do the praying hands motion and that's it you want it so I do the praying hand to get it evenly saturated and then I scrunch to get that curl activation going okay so that's it Now I'm going to go sit under the hooded dryer for probably about 20 minutes and then I'll be back to diffuse and we're going to see how this definition is. We're going to see what this hold is talking about and I'll be back. All right guys, so I'm back. I just got from under the dryer and these are my results. So my hair is definitely a little crunchy um, from the jello shot, putting that topper. But it's not bad because I'm actually going to break it when I stretch my hair with the blow dryer. Um, so I'm going to go in and do that off camera and come show you the final results.
Okay, you guys, so I am back after stretching my hair. After stretching it with the blow dryer, it's much, much softer. Like that broke up the cast like right away. Let's get to the start of the show. So these products were actually sent to me by EcoSlay. So shout out to EcoSlay for sending me some PR. Um, but I really wanted to try these two things. I've heard a lot about them. I've had clients that have told me about them. I've seen countless videos. So I wanted to try them and review them for myself. Um, first, I'll say the Orange Marmalade. This is Flaxseed and Aloe Curl Definer. This one is creamier. The smell is amazing. So I used this one first. Um, and I really like the definition that this gave my hair, but I definitely could tell I need more hold. Um, so that's why I went in with the Jello Shot. I would definitely recommend using this as a topper going all over your head versus doing section by section because the hold is very strong and it will make your hair very crunchy. Um, other than that, like I said, the smell of both of these products are amazing. They work really well together. My hair feels really, really good. These are the results. As you can see, it's really soft. So it is possible to get good definition without super crunchy hair. You just have to play around with your method. And that's that. I hope you guys enjoy because I am loving this wash and go. Shout out to EcoSlave for sending me these products. I am so excited and I can't wait to use them again. 10 out of 10 recommend. If you are on the fence, if this is something you, like me, have been seeing for a long time and you just don't know whether or not to try it, go ahead and do it because I love the results. My hair feels amazing and I appreciate you guys for watching. I will see you in the next video and don't forget to subscribe.